Hey guys, it's Katie here and today what I'm going to share with you is how to clean out your um, email list in Kartra and how to export it and save it um, to make sure you have it saved on your hard drive or laptop um, because you know you never know you have to make sure that you are saving your list um, on a continuous basis um, you know once a month once in two weeks or once in two months depends how fast your list is growing and how fast you want to you know update it and save it so let's go ahead and get started but before that um, if you're not subscribed to my channel yet I would love to have you as a part of my tribe here on YouTube if you're interested in learning things like um, you know building your business online making money online you know making money from home um, you know traffic generation lead conversion or anything that has to do with um, building an online business um, go ahead and subscribe I provide um, at least two videos a week and share with you you know different strategies tips and uh, ways on how you can make money online and how you can grow your business with that said let's go ahead and get started um, if you are not sure what Kartra is, it's basically an all-in-one platform that I use to build my online business with. If you're familiar with like ClickFunnels, GetResponse, um, Aweber or any of these type of tools, Kartra is uh, basically um, all these in one. So I do email marketing with it, you know, I, uh, I build my list with it, I create pages, funnels, campaigns, I host videos, I create membership sites with it, um, I uh, sell my products, you know, my own products as well as affiliate pro products um, through Kartra. So it's basically an all-in-one platform where I go to and wh what I use to build my business with. Um, I used to use other tools like ClickFunnels and GetResponse and um, you know different tools uh, that most of the marketers use but um, when I came across Kartra I was just mind blown that everything is under one roof and I can just you know go in there and uh, build my whole business by using just one platform. So um, that's where I'm building my list in and that's what I'm going to use um, to show you what I do to clean out my list and to export it and save it to my um, hard drive. So let's do it. So the first thing what I would do is, since I have not uh, saved my list in a while already, what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, export it before I clean it out. Just, you know, to uh, make sure I have like all of these emails and everybody um, saved on my hard drive just in case. I probably don't need them but I will go ahead and save it just in case. So in order to do that what I will do is uh, I am logged in into Kartra right now and I am in my communications folder here and I clicked on my leads or leads right here. So uh, what I do is I just click um, this um, box or this circle here. What that does, it basically checks all of uh, the leads. And the next thing that I would do is I would go ahead and click on action. And just scroll down uh, where it says export and click export. That's it. That's, you know, as simple as that. Um, you can save your leads to your desktop and then from desktop obviously you can save it to um, your hard drive or wherever you want to keep it. Uh, what I will do I'll just drag it from the downloads to the desktop so to make sure they are on my desktop. So um, that's basically how you download the whole list that you have. So um, let's go ahead and clean it out. Uh, make sure we only have people who are engaging who are opening my emails and who are um, you know are good quality leads uh, that I have here in my Kartra account so in order to do that what I will do I will go ahead and um, uncheck that and what I'm going to do is click on these advanced filters right here and click select and scroll all the way down to um, level of engagement and then click that and then uh, where it says select level type I'll click that and then I'll um, click 
has not opened any email and I'll put uh, in at least 180 days that's about six months so and I'll click add so um, all of these leads basically haven't opened or haven't engaged in my you know uh, in opening emails or anything like that um, in the past six months so what I'm going to do is I'll just click um, you know select all right here so the first thing that I'm going to do is I will click action and I will actually export these leads so I have a separate folder of um, you know all these leads that haven't been active you know just in case I want to use them in the future or you know sell them or whatever I want to do with them so I went ahead and um, exported them you know all of the leads who were not active in the last six months and what I'm going to do is I will um, drag it to my desktop and just change the um, you know the, the name of this file all right, so I saved them as leads not active in the last six months and I put today's date so I know um, when I exported that list. Um, so the next thing what I'm going to do is, you know, they're all selected here. I will go ahead and click action and de delete leads right here. And that's basically it. Um, that's how you get rid of the emails um, and leads that have not been active um, in whatever time frame you want them, you know, to to be. Uh, some people do it who haven't been active in the last three months. Um, I just decided to do it in the last six months. Um, just you know, my personal choice. So that's it. That's how you clean out your list, and that's how you save um, the list to your desktop. I will actually go ahead and save my um, active list as well. So I know these are the leads that have been active in the last six months so I will go ahead and check it and just click export you can um, just separate them right away um, I just decided to you know save it um, as one file all of them and then separated them you know and saved it separately so but you can separate it right away if you want and just save it separately um, so that's it there here and I will go ahead and drag it to my desktop and just name it as this is my active list as of today all right so they're all saved and my list is now clean and um, all I have is active people who are actually engaging in opening emails and buying my products and things like that so um, that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Hope that kind of makes sense to you of how you clean out your list and how you um, save it and export it to your desktop or hard drive. The reason why you want to save your list, you know, every two weeks a month or every two months is because um, you never know you know what's going to happen with any of the platforms that you're using to build your list on i've come across a few marketers who told me that um, all of a the sudden their accounts were shut down and they couldn't get their list you know out of the account and they did build a big enough list um you know in that specific account so i would definitely recommend to save your list you know at least every month um, in order to have it in your computer and like to own it so that's it for this video um, hope you guys enjoyed it go ahead and subscribe if you haven't yet um, as well as if you haven't checked out my new ebook that i've uh, recently released the seven aspects of building a successful internet business go ahead and check that out as well i will post um, the link below this video and i would love to see you on the inside Otherwise, I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye. Blessings.